Praise be to God. Daily One Missionary Biography. Today's Missionary Samuel Marston. Year of birth 25/7/1764. Year of death 12/5/1838. Place not known. Country Australia. Place of vision New Zealand. It was a period when the Roman Empire was consolidating and many people were working for it. Once a wise man saw a worker and asked what he was doing. The worker replied, I am breaking the stones. He went forward a few steps and asked another person the same question. He replied, I am carving a pillar out of a stone. He asked the same question to the third worker and he replied, I am building a great temple along with many other people. From the conversation, the wise man inferred that the first person was worried about his livelihood and the person was concentrating on the day's work. But the third person had a bigger purpose in doing his work. Samuel Marsden was one such person who had a bigger purpose of expanding the kingdom of God. Marsden was born into an artisan family and lost his parents while he was yet a child. Before he could graduate, he responded to God's call to serve him an overseas mission in Australia. In the next few years, Marsden was busy serving not merely as a chaplain but also as a magistrate there. But his heart longed to evangelize the Maoris, the indigenous people in New Zealand. In 1814, he set out in search of Maori people who were wild, uncivilized barbarians who ate human flesh and fought fiercely. Marston tried to build trust with Maori chiefs and worked to change these people for Christ. He visited New Zealand seven times and established several schools, seminaries, and churches. He fought against his own people who were exploiting the Maoris. The love of Jesus changed the lives of the natives. He was why New Zealand saw the light of Christianity and so he is remembered as Apostle of New Zealand. Beloved, are you prepared to go in search of people who know not the Christ? God bless you.